So this is my patient Stephanie and Stephanie obviously stressed out. For those of you who do muscle testing, one of the things you can do is a little pinch test and as bizarre as it may seem, theoretically what it represents, which one is more accurate. So for example, with, with Stephanie, two of the areas of her cervical spine facilitate her muscles, both her upper cervicals and her C3, C4 area. But the pinch test helped differentiate which area I was actually going to adjust. So Stephanie is one of our patients that's both suffering from stress and of course has physical pain. So with her, we're doing a combination of both massage, chiropractic, we're actually modifying her diet to deal with some of her anxiety and getting her on some nutritional supplements to help calm down her underlying stress issues, keep her cortisol levels in check, doing some cerebellum exercises to make certain that her left and right cerebellum stay in sync with one another. So the combination of that works really well. During the holidays, she starts to experience more stress. So during that, we put her on an accelerated program where we see her more frequently, and that keeps her stress levels in check. On an interesting side note, I have been treating Stephanie for 16 years. I'm a little shocked to speak those words and to think how long ago I was when I first got out of practice and started treating her. And 16 years later, she's still a patient. junction because we're actually going to get directly adjusted from posterior to anterior. Oh. You okay? Yeah. Okay, close. I'm going to blind you by turning on lots of light. You ready? Sorry, Steve. <laughs> Okay. Fine. Close. Open. Close. Open. When the TMJ is out of place, just like when the cervical spine or T7 or the TL junction's out, patients can have a real increased load in their ability to be anxious. But we're going to use it on your mom. Can we're just I grab one? Walk around, step for a little bit, just see how you feel. Can I try? The balloon? Sure, I guess. Sure, yeah, go ahead, hop on it. How do you feel? <laughs> I feel like I'm taller on one side. Is that because I've just been? Steph, how was that jaw adjustment for you? I know it was not comfortable, but how did you feel after the adjustment? I I really felt it, and it, I feel some relief, and it. It was very uncomfortable, but I feel like it needed to be done. <laughs> so thank you.